Let's now determine the common difference of this uh, arithmetic sequence uh, given as a n equals uh, 17 plus 8 n. Remember that uh, common difference is the difference obtained uh, between any two consecutive terms in an arithmetic sequence. So to find the common difference, I'm going to first define the a1. So a1 is found by substituting uh, n as 1 in this uh, formula that is uh, n equal to 1. So therefore, this becomes 17 plus 8 times of 1. So we have 17 plus 8 equals 25. I'm now going to find the, the consecutive term that is a2 by replacing n as 2. So this becomes 17, time, 17 plus 8 times of 2. So this equals 17 plus uh, 16, which is uh, 33. Now the common difference uh, indicated by letter D this equals the difference between these two terms that is uh, a2 minus a1. So this equals uh, 33 minus 25 and this is equal to 8. So therefore the common difference of this arithmetic sequence is 8. Now let's determine the a39. So this is part 1 and let's answer the part 2. That is we have to determine a39. So this can be found by replacing n as 39. So therefore, this becomes 17 plus 8 times of, uh, we replace n by 39, so it is 8 times of 39. And we can multiply 8 with 39, so we get uh, 312. So when we add these two, we get uh, 329. So therefore, 839 equals uh, 329. Now let's answer part 3, that is, so we have to find the recursive formula. So the recursive formula, we can utilize this uh, formula that is a n equals a n minus 1 plus the common difference d. So we can basically utilize this formula to find the recursive formula. So therefore a n equals uh, a n minus 1 plus the common difference is 8. And we will also have to denote that n is greater than or equal to 2 because this recursive formula is uh, applicable only when n is greater than or equal to 2. We will now find the common difference of this uh, sequence that is a n is given as negative 5 by 2 plus 3 by 2 n. So first uh, I'm going to find a 1 by replacing n as 1. So this becomes uh, negative 5 by 2 plus uh, 3 by 2 times of 1 which is basically 3 by 2. So we can add these uh, fractions. Uh, so this becomes a1 equals negative 5 plus 3 over 2. And this gives uh, negative 2 over 2. So therefore a1 equal to negative 1. Now let's find uh, a2 by replacing n equal to 2 into this uh, arithmetic sequence. So therefore this becomes a negative 5 by 2 plus uh, 3 by 2 times of 2. Now this can be written as uh, negative 5 plus 3 times 2 is 6 over 2. So this becomes 6 minus 5 is half. That is 1 by 2. So we have uh, a1 and a2. So therefore the common difference is a uh, difference between the two consecutive terms. Here we can find it as uh, a2 minus of a1. That is uh, equal to 1 by 2 minus of minus 1. Because a1 equal to negative 1. So therefore this becomes half plus 1 which equals uh, 3 by 2. Therefore the common difference is uh, 3 by 2. Now we answer the part 2 which is we have to determine the a22. So let's find a22 by replacing n equals 22 into this arithmetic sequence. So therefore this becomes negative 5 by 2 plus uh, 3 by 2 times of uh, 22. So this equals negative 5 plus uh, 3 times of 22 is 66 over 2. So this gives, uh, it is uh, positive, that is 61 by 2. So you can write down this as a mixed fraction as uh, 30 and off. So therefore the A22 is 30 and off. And finally we will find the recursive formula. Uh, the recursive formula, we can utilize the formula that is uh, a n minus 1 plus the common difference d. 
So therefore, this implies the recursive formula for this uh, arithmetic sequence is a n equals uh, a n minus 1 plus the common difference is uh, 3 by 2. And this is applicable when n greater than or equal to 2. So this is the recursive formula of this arithmetic sequence.